Hi, and welcome to this third video on navigating the Rangeland Analysis Platform. In this video, we're going to explore how you can import your geographies to analyze your regions of interest within the RAP. In the last video, you'll remember that we dove into the Map Layers panel. And while it can be really interesting to explore the different layers available in RAP, the real power comes in being able to analyze the data for your region of interest. One thing you should know is that the analysis will ultimately be performed over all of the pixels in your region of interest. The diagram shown here can help you to understand how that works. We have three ways to import geographies into RAP. The first is to draw a feature within the application. The second is to import a shapefile. And the third is to select a preloaded fire polygon. Let's walk through each of those now. The first option we'll cover is how to draw a feature interactively in RAP. To show you how to do this, we're going to zoom in on a specific location, North Platte, Nebraska, and focus on the Los Canyons region to the southeast of this area. To start drawing a feature, you can click the Draw Features button and then simply start drawing your, your feature. It can be a point, a line, or a polygon, and you simply double click to end creation of the geometry. Then the analysis will run and you're ready to go. Next, you can upload a shapefile. The shapefile should be zipped and in a folder on your local computer. Then you can click the Upload Shapefile button, select the shapefile from your local hard drive, which isn't shown in my image, and it'll pop up on the screen. You'll see in, mine, in my shapefile there are three polygons, and to run analysis for one of the polygons, I simply click on it and there's an option to calculate the time series. When I click Calculate Time Series, the analysis panel will pop up and analysis will start running. The final option is to use a preloaded fire perimeter already available within RAP. To do this, you'll simply click the Display Fire Boundaries option in the Map uh, Layers panel, select the year of the fire you're interested in, and then you just have to click the polygon and there'll be a text box that will pop up with a button to calculate the time series. The analysis will run and you'll be ready to go. If you need any more explanation of anything in this video, be sure and check out the help documentation below it on our webpage. Additionally, there'll be help for uploading shape files there if you're having any trouble. I'm really glad you joined us for this video on analyzing your region of interest. In the next video, we're going to explore the types of analysis that you can get out of RAP. So be sure and join us for the next video. In the meantime, the best way to learn this stuff is to get into RAP and get some experience. So be sure and check it out.